Hello everyone, welcome to Excel problem solving series. So I have a very interesting problem for today. So you can see onto my screen, we have two inputs, input one and input two. And in input one, I have the name of the students and the marks scored by them into the science subject. Similarly, in input two, I have the name of the students and the marks scored by them into the math subject. You can see below, I want to add up both the input tables and I want to get the output something like, uh, which is mentioned into the below. So you can see this particular table I want to get. Input one, I have one of the students whose name is missing and the marks is missing. And in input two, we have the other student whose name is missing and similarly the marks is missing. But into the output table, I just want to add both the inputs. I'm not concerned with the marks of this student is mentioned or not. It, it should come up as a blank cell. You can see here, uh, these are blank cells so in input one elisa science marks is not present similarly for bob is maths marks is not present in to the input two so let's see how to do this now you might have a question here we can do this very easily using the vlookup function so let's see how to if we can solve this problem using the vlookup function so i would just copy this particular input here and i would paste it and i would do it separately so i would just apply the vlookup function here table this is two so you can see okay i've got the 40 marks so this was the marks for science this is the marks for maths great i would just drag this column to the very down and you can see okay no worries i've got na here i can also remove this using the if any function so i would just apply the if any function to substitute this so you can see i've got the output here but if you would notice i would have to do separately for each of the input and i would have to join this you can see aliza marks are missing here into the output which we have got so you can see how cumbersome this task is because we need to do it separately for each and other input so let's see how to do this simultaneously we'll just get the output first of all you would need to go to the data tab then you would need to click onto the consolidate button here and you can see we need to provide both the ranges here so our first range is from the input one so let us give it so we'll just select the range one first of all we'll click on add similarly we will just click on to the range two and we'll click on add and we need to check box onto both these options here then we'll click ok so you can see we have got the output here we have the names into the very first column and we have the science marks and the math marks you can see into the output we have got bob and elisa name also and there but the marks are not present but wanted to get all the students name and we just wanted to make a report of such kind so i hope you have found this video very much useful so if you had found this video helpful do like this video and subscribe to my channel to receive such kind of useful video on a daily basis meet you in the next video thank you so much